Earthquakes have always been part of life here in Southern California, and the Malibu earthquake a couple of weeks ago reminded us of just that. KCAL meteorologist Marina Jurica dives deep into the sciences of shakes and why California has so many. Here's this week's What on Earth. Earthquakes are the way the planet lets off steam. Earthquakes occur when there's a sudden release of energy in the Earth's crust. The Earth's crust is like a giant jigsaw puzzle made up of all of these tectonic plates. Now, when these plates rub against each other, tension builds up until boom, they slip, causing an earthquake. Did you know that most earthquakes happen along plate boundaries? One of the most notorious regions is the Pacific Ring of Fire, where about 90% of the world's earthquakes occur, and California is a part of this. In Southern California, specifically along the San Andreas Fault, earthquakes are quite common due to the movement of these tectonic plates. But there are many fault lines, as you can see here on this map, up and down the California coastline as well. Now, earthquakes help scientists understand the Earth's inner workings. And by studying all of this seismic activity and these seismic waves, scientists can map the Earth's interior. A cool fact, Southern California experiences about 10 thousand earthquakes each year, but most are too small to be felt by humans. And another fascinating aspect is the moment magnitude scale, which measures the magnitude of earthquakes. Every unit increase represents a tenfold increase in the amplitude of the seismic waves. Think about a stack of 10 blocks. If you push on it, the top block might wobble a little. Now that's a magnitude six earthquake. Now imagine 10 stacks of 10 blocks. Well, if you push down down on the top block of that stack, then we're going to be looking at the same force more than likely knocking over some of the other stacks because it releases 10 times more energy as a magnitude 7. So the next time you feel the ground rumble beneath your feet, remember, earthquakes are not just a natural phenomenon. They're a window into the dynamic forces that shape our planet. And that's what's on Earth for this week. Thanks for tuning in.